Hello, Lilas. Welcome back to my channel, guys. Guys, today I am here with baby Sasha, and I'm going to show her she's had her hair rooted. I haven't decided which way I really want to style it, which way I like it best. Um, but she just got home, and I'm just kind of getting, trying to get used to her with hair. Believe it or not, it is an adjustment. Like, I've gotten so used to seeing her ball until... Now it's like, oh, I got this new baby here. <laughs> and um, Sasha is the Gabby Gill kit by Claire Teller, painted by myself and rooted by Sentimental Babies, which roots for me a lot. Um, some babies I root myself, like my silicone babies, I root myself. And I will probably start rooting some of the, like, the preemie heads of the vinyl. But that's about as much as I can give you guys. That's about all I can do because, baby, it just takes too much time child i'd rather just pay them them, them hundreds and get it done anyway um guys if you're not subscribed to this channel go ahead and subscribe to this channel click the bell to be a part of the notification squad and most importantly give this video a thumbs up and share it with all your dolly friends and whatever friends um now okay so let's 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 look at sasha poop so oh i wanted to zoom in to her little her will wait. Her will wait. I show sweet. So, um, I am going to try to put her on this wonder suit, um, that was sent to me years ago from a friend in the community, which I don't know what. I see her doing some other things, but, um, every now and then on Instagram, but she kind of just stopped YouTube. Um, which was bubble 75. I don't you know, I miss her videos, but um Anyway, I hope everything is well with her, but she sent me this in a um, A box we we both sent each other a box of stuff one time and she sent me like some wonderful stuff um, Anyway, I'll share another story about that later but um anyway so that's let's let's get let's get her dressed so also guys i know you guys have been tuning in to tea time tuesday um that is a new thing that i want to do every tuesday so you guys make sure you set your clocks every morning i will do an upload on tuesday that is the goal um on sundays i will be doing my pregnancy vlog and keeping you guys up to date with that little mini series that will be going on as well. Um, I don't know if I should keep her socks on. But this is her without her socks just in case you guys wanted to see. Let me see if I can. Um, I took her some photos but I feel like. I feel like right now. I feel like. The co her coloring is actually showing more accurate than the photos. But sometimes what I see and then what comes out on the camera later is a little different. But anyway, so those are her feet. I am going to keep her socks on for right now. Keep her socks on for right now. I have quite a bit of things that in store for you guys, but... Definitely Tea Time Tuesday is, you know, it will I mean, try to have some, you know, some good information. But, of course, you know, I got to keep it silly as well. And I do appreciate all my sisters in the community that have even private messaged me and told me that they enjoyed the, um, the commentary. <laughs> but I got to be careful not to, you know, do too much where somebody get their feelings in a for real bunch but um anywho um we want to laugh but not at someone else's expense um so yeah I'm gonna put her on a onesie so I had her you'll see I had her with um I like the way the the rooter had styled her hair but I haven't been able to play with it enough to try to get it back to that way but I had um she had a little 
ponytail up at the top um which i thought was cute and um yeah so oh my goodness oh my goodness mama oh y'all don't know how i felt like you know sitting at the office yesterday and waiting on her she she had come she had been delivered early and i had to sit to the office hours hours afterwards it was driving me insane you hear me i was like i, need to, I felt like i just i felt like i was getting a new baby i just wanted to see her with her hair um like i said i don't think i did a good job at styling it right now the hair is so super soft i mean this is like the most soft hair and it just lays like it really lays so i really like that um but like i said i just i haven't decided what's the best way to style it um it's crazy that when you get a baby how much you you know doing the hair little things change them change the way they look the way you feel about them all types of things i was a little nervous at first i was like oh gosh it feels different for her with hair believe it or not i'm so used to my babies being bald that's crazy <laughs> My personal babies, but I do like the way that her hair is. I just need to, are you going to put your hands through or are you going to cover it up? But yeah, so I'm excited about her. Now we can wear some different outfits that don't require a hat. That's, that's the biggest thing, I think. You know, when they don't have hair, some outfits, I'll be like, oh, I don't really want to put them on that because I don't want to mess it up with trying to find a matching hat, you know. Um, although she still will wear hats with hair. I just, sometimes I just, you know, sometimes you just want to be able to put the outfit on and not, you know, have a hat on. So, have you guys ever got a baby had a baby had something done to them and then lost the bond like say you sent it off for an upgrade or something to be changed or fixed that you thought was wrong and then get the baby back and then you don't you don't bond with it um i've heard people do that that's why i'm always kind of worried <laughs> when i send a baby out for here i'm like oh my god i don't want it to be this time you know um But I did feel different with her with hair. I won't lie. But I'm 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 still very much bonded to her. Before the video, actually, I held her for a while, and I was debating should I do a sit down video, or you know. But y'all know with this big old belly, I can't I can't I can't be doing no sit downs like that too much with trying to hold a baby and and, and then got the big belly going on so yeah i don't know let me get this um brush now i don't even know where my little sprayer at so i'm being real ghetto guys i am literally dipping the the brush in a bottle of water <laughs> so i am yeah i'm being super ghetto with that so but ain't nothing wrong with being a little ghetto that's what I heard. <laughs> That's what I heard. But yeah, so I don't know. Like she, the, 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 the rooter had it going. She had it going all which ways in the front. Hang on, let me get some more water on this. <laughs> See, it'd be nice if I just sprayed it, but I don't know where my spray thing at. I got to look. I'm always doing I'm, my babies is all over the house so they in like one two 
three different rooms sometimes four or five different rooms so sometimes they stuff just end up in different places okay so i don't know if she had it like that i can't remember i gotta look at the picture but it just felt like she had a lot more swooping going on Wait, that's that hair going over there. Because you have to brush the hair according to the, in the direction that it's rooted. Or sometimes it just, but see, this is just coming forward. So I could do, I can go either way. I can go either way with, with this part. I don't know, child. We're going to have to figure it out. Because right now, this ain't it. So, I don't know. I got to figure out how I'm going to style the front of her hair. I mean, it look real natural no matter what I do. Oh, look at you got bangs. I don't like babies with bangs too much. Um, I mean, it, it, it looks natural. No matter what, but I don't know. I gotta figure it out. And the back is pretty long. I might cut that part a little bit. I may cut it just a little bit in the back. But I do like my baby's hair to run down the, the nape of their neck. Because I don't, I don't like him stopping all the way up there. But, yeah. So, I don't know. This, sometimes... It take a while for me to get comfortable with the hair. So, anyway, thanks guys for watching. I will take photos of my little one soon. It is so cold. It is so cold. There you go. It's cold in here. Let me see what you guys see. And then I'm going to Oh, I knocked my water over. And then I'm going to get with y'all later because, child, I don't be knowing what I be doing. All right. See? It has going every which way. <laughs> I got to figure it out. It was so pretty in the um, Ruder's photo. I don't know how to get it back i'm gonna take my time see when people be taking their time and swerving the curls and all in the stuff i can't i can't go with that <laughs> i'm not good at that anyway later bye